Hi, my name is Monica and I'm from the Allentown YMCA and today you're going to come and help me do a fine motor activity which is making a puzzle out of police equipment. And today's equipment I chose to do a car on one side of my recycling box and a star on the other side and we're going to try to make a puzzle so that we can continue working on our fine motor skills. So I brought a black marker. Those of you who have artistic parents or siblings could probably draw it without it. So I'm gonna kinda draw my cop car. And how many wheels does a cop car have on it, huh? How many wheels? Ooh, that's a mighty fine looking cop car. I don't know. I got to work on those car skills. And then on this side, I'm going to do a star because what's the star for? Who knows? I know, I know, I know. When a cop usually has a star badge, right? Mm -hmm. So we are going to draw a huge star so that we can cut it out and do our puzzle from there. And what does the star usually have around it? A circle, right? And inside, there's usually a number, right? Let's see if I can do a number. Let's say number five. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. Now we're going to ask our parents for scissors. And we are going to cut along, cut along our shape of our car. My car looks a little funny, but it's okay. Because everybody has a different look. You might have a long car, you might have a truck, whatever you may want. I chose the, the cruiser. Got my little headlight right there. And you can color your car whatever color you want. You don't have to color. It depends on you. Make sure I got my wheel there. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Look at that nice cop car, huh? What? I'm going to color it. What color is a car usually? A cop car? Blue. So I'm gonna shade mine in a little blue. Gotta make sure I do a shaded blue car. And what color is the siren or the, the light that goes off? Oh, I know, I know, I know. It is red, if you remember. Have you ever seen a cop car, right? So I'm going to shade that in with red. Get my red marker here. Shade it in here. Oh, yeah. That means you are in big trouble. What color are my wheels? My wheels are usually black. Have some spokes there, right? There we go. And how many wheels does my car have? Right here you see two, but there should be two, there should be four wheels because there's two on one side and two on the other side, right? You like my nice cruiser? I love my nice cruiser. And then we're going to take it and we're going to cut a squiggly line. Work on that fine motor, right? Puzzle piece number one. And then we're going to make another, maybe I'll make a zigzag. And 
Then I'm going to make an oval. And those are my puzzle pieces, right? Here we go. So that's puzzle number one of my police car. And now I'm going to make, get my badge going. I made a big badge so everyone can see my badge. Let me cut that out real quick. And who remembers the number that I put on my badge? Badge number five. Put my straps to the side. Let's see. Maybe I'll color the star in red. And you can color whatever color you want. Some people like yellow or gold. I love red. So the inside of my star next to my number five is gonna be red. Keep coloring, color, 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 color. And who remembers what we're gonna make with this? We're gonna make another puzzle. You're right, exactly. And this is gonna be you can many shades of colors you want. I'll put a little blue on there because we're going to connect them, right? And this one I'm going to show you a little different because I'm actually not going to cut my star in half. I'm going to cut around my star. Let's see if I can do that. I'm going to cut some shapes like this. the triangle uh, maybe I'll do an oval here so how many pieces do I have here I have one two three four Five. And in the end, after you're all done, you have made your own little puzzle. So my first puzzle is my car. Let me see if I can put my car back together. Oh, it's going to be a little tricky. Oh, I think I got it. car puzzle perfect working on those great fine motor skill and then who remembers what these five pieces turned out to be they were my badge and what number was it badge number five let me see if i can figure out how to get this badge together no this might be a little tricky just a little tricky. I'll try to trick myself up. And there we go. We have now made a fine motor with our cop equipment. We have the cop equipment of a car and we have the badge. And it's our little puzzle. How cool is that? Thanks for coming out and doing fine motor with Miss Monkle. See you next time. Bye.